This, Bill, is a, an oil pressure switch that NASA used to buy. Well, their oil switch, with all of the cabling, costs $328. This oil switch, we paid over $10,000 for it. So what accounts for that huge difference? Gouging. What, what else can account for it? The roots of the problem can be traced to 1993, when the Pentagon, looking to cut costs, urged defense companies to merge. 51 major contractors consolidated to five giants. The landscape has totally changed. In the 80s, there was intense competition amongst a number of companies. And so the government had choices. They had leverage. We have limited leverage now. The Pentagon is losing the battle to hold down prices. So uh, explain to me, why can't the Department of Defense just step up to Transdime and say, no, we're not going to pay that? Because we don't have another source for a lot of the spares that they provide right now. They are the literally only game in town in order to make uh, an aircraft fly. Uh, so th we're at their mercy. Does that make sense to any of you? No. It is very concerning to me. Contractors see that they can do this. They are the ones that hold the power. So it's not really a, a true capitalistic market because one, one company is telling you what's going to happen. So if it's not a capitalistic system, what is it? It's a monopoly. Monopoly. 快来订阅通识，按旁边小铃铛给我们点赞和分享哦。如果有什么想说的，也欢迎在下面多多留言。